Mark Schuo. Well, that, I don't know. Uh, that's tough to call, though, because if they've only played twice since January. We, we've only played twice, I think. But or you he, beat we, No, no, no. We played at a bar tournament and he beat me there. Oh, okay. So you're wrong, Grodin. Get your facts straight, bro. <laughs> that's because I think Coin is getting that information from his own, like, data collection and he doesn't include bar tournaments in that. Oh. I was going to say it's because Coin is, like, a bad player. <laughs> no. Wait, do you know who that is? Yeah, Broden? Coin. Coin, yeah. Oh, Luigi the Luigi player? player? Yeah. Oh, nice. Not counting bar tournaments? Oh, okay. Oh, can I, I squeeze you. in on commentary for this? Yeah. Uh, unless Kalindi uh, doesn't want to give up a seat. He's yeah, adding yeah. a lot of uh, insightful up. information. What about I'll just grab a chair and you can still charge your phone? Like, yeah. like in game, Kalindi's presence is felt. Uh, Kalindi, when are you going to win Are You in Sunshine? <laughs> What do you mean? I don't know. Oh, Ooh, when, when is my next sunshine? Sick. Ginger knows your main. Over here. Yeah, I saw you beat Tech Boy. Hopefully tomorrow. Okay. Uh, okay. What's up? He's <laughs> always going to hate you. Yo, what's um, up, Heart Sphinx? I'll critique your commentary while you're doing it. Right. Uh, right. so far, Dynamic Walrus. Pretty solid combos from Dynamic. Um, He used to be really bad at this matchup, <laughs> to be really? honest. Now he's uh, he's pretty good at it, I would say. He's good at... He's good at spacing defensive moves and walling out Sheik. Mm -hmm. um, it's like probably his biggest strength. And uh, for a Sheik like Walrus, who loves to go in, this is like dynamics. Like mm -hmm. this is wheelhouse, I would say. If he wants right. to play against a Sheik, it's gonna be Walrus because he can just like kind of play his spacing game forever. Mm -hmm. And um, stuff his approaches. Oh my God, that was sick. There's like uh, he has done three things dynamic that if uh, if Walrus knew the counterplay to these three things, he could have punished uh, dynamic for it. The first thing being up throw, uh, he didn't DI the up throw correctly, up throw, mm -hmm. so he got up throw to back air, which sent him off stage. He yeah. also didn't OMS attack either of the down smashes once he poofed on stage, which right. honestly you should just be doing that every single time when you're Sheik. Mm -hmm. And then uh, he could have also shield grabbed the West Ball's pressure. Uh, That's really hard. <laughs> it's not that hard. Clint uh, does it literally every time to me. You have to know it's coming. West Ball's pressure? I feel like not really. Can you just I react? Mean, kind of. I feel like I feel like you, you have to you like have to have like a primed reaction. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Yeah. 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 I feel like you can't just like raw like. So primed reaction. First time he, he first time these players have ever, like probably played in a while and then no, he no, okay. he quad shines or like West Ball shines. Okay, I can see that, but he know. also shouldn't be rolling out of the coin. But those sure. are like just okay. Falco specific things. Yeah. That like it could have been punished if he had the match. Yeah. The, the roll was definitely like way too obvious because dynamic just sat there. Oh yeah. He just he just knew. It was though. I really like the read. Yeah. Oh, there you go. There. Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay. Ooh. You know, I thought he burned his jump there. The first time and thought I should roll. So, like, <laughs> the second time, he just probably rolled right there. Right, right. Turn my mic off? Is that what that says? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, turn off Heartstrings mic. Uh, <laughs> wow. <laughs> I can't actually read the, so the end of the chat. So, that was actually really solid by yeah. Dynamic. Uh, he put Walrus into shield a lot and punished him a lot for it. Uh, I'd like to see a little bit more shine grab from Dynamic, but uh, yeah, the the shield pressure options that he's using right now are pretty effective, uh, just on the base level. So that's good. If Walrus doesn't adapt, then he can just keep spamming the exact same things he's doing right now, and he'll just win. Hmm. I hate when the laser doesn't come out. That was good spacing, getting out of the corner, baiting people uh, with Falco just by like jumping and then falling back down is actually extremely effective because as soon as they see you jump, they're like, "Oh shit!" He like goes so high that I need to contest him up there. Right. Uh, and then if you fast fall back down, a lot of times you also fall faster than most people. So that was a really solid bait. I like the laser out of the corner too. Vintage Mango. Uh, I don't like the non-grounded shine a shield, but you know, whatever. <laughs> Oh, it's just standing way too close to the Yeah, yeah that, that was bad. <laughs> There's, uh, oh, okay. That's that's a mid-level oh, player's yeah. biggest problem, I think, what? is they stand too close to the corner. Mm, you yeah. need to watch all five gods, literally all five gods, maybe excluding Mango just because he's an idiot sometimes. But if you watch him when he's playing hot, he's, he's like, at a perfect spacing to do corner pressure. I see. Their, their spacing to do corner pressure is amazing. Like, if you watch Leffen, he's standing in the zone where it's like, what the hell do I do? Like, right. he's either going to full hot back air me or up tilt me, and I can't do anything about it. I and see. the way that PP uh, punishes in the corner is Marth. He dash dances in that same zone. It's like, well, I can't go above him. I can't go through him because he's dashing back. Like, I don't know what to do out of this corner right now. They put on so much pressure. That's sick. But mid-level players always stand either too close or too far. I see. I see. Mango is actually very good at, at corner pressuring from the platforms. I honestly think that's like Oh, yeah, I've seen strength. that so much against Sheik all yes, the time. especially against Sheik. Yeah. Okay. Good conversion. I don't like that. Yeah, I don't like the <laughs> He just, he just let it whip. Oh, okay. Interesting. I think he, he just sided me the wrong way. <laughs> yeah. Um, I don't like that he just let it rip. He didn't, like, 
I feel like you can. What you can do is you can. Oh, what uh -oh. the heck? <laughs> I feel like what you can do there is you can charge, sit there charging needles to bait out the up B, uh, against and Falco, then go out and, and then go hit him. I like that. Yeah. Um, I, it doesn't ever work on you. <laughs> it works on other Falcos a I'm, lot. I'm not afraid. <laughs> I'm gonna um, do whatever was in my mind. Yeah. Because I know it's just one big mix-up game. Right. But whatever visual like cue you try to hit me with to confuse me uh, generally doesn't work. Yeah. Like Kalindi does this thing where he double jumps out and then like comes back in really quick to like scare me into thinking like he's gonna go out and shine spike me. Yeah. So that I like start my recovery option right then, but like I, I'm just like I know you're just trying to scare me, and even if you're not trying to scare me and I choose the wrong option, I know I'm dead. Whatever. Right. Yeah. I, I'm fine. I'm either gonna die or I'm gonna live. Like, I like that a lot. Yeah. I was even hitting with whatever mix-up you're gonna hit me with. I, I was even hitting Trillium with it, so I, I think it's like pretty good. But you just like never get hit. I thought like for a while I was like doubting my like visual base at the ledge. <laughs> I was like I literally cannot edge guard Ginger. <laughs> I just think once you understand the complete mix-up game of the edge guards, it's like. Yeah. Uh, I'm just gonna choose this because I think they're gonna do that. I like, see. You can dance around on stage all you want, but I think that you're gonna cover this, so I'm gonna go for this. I see. So Dynamic is sort of making a comeback right now. Oh, the zoo! Hello. Uh, this is really doable for Falco. You can never count Falco out in this matchup. Agreed. I've made one million three stock comebacks against Sheik. Uh, you just get her off stage one time and then you just back air to death. Uh, especially Walrus not being able to do the... the what's it called? Ams attack. It's like, ooh, uh, yeah. that's gonna be it though. He definitely could have done that. Like, Walsh is getting kind of antsy, but mm -hmm. I mean, he, he definitely SD twice. Really it was like a pseudo SD yeah. the first one though. Yeah, like, yeah, he, yeah. he was like off stage, like probably gonna get edge guarded. The yeah. second one just like right ran right off the stage. Dynamic force doctor Zelda. Zelda's ne really bad, dude. E enter the next tournament is Omar is handsome 420. I'm about it, dude. <laughs> it says Omar. Oh, Omar is. Yeah, I thought that was an L. <laughs> Uh, Walrus not being very cognizant of Dynamic's crotch cancel to the point where Dynamic was literally like, when Walrus was on the platform, he knew like seconds ahead that he was gonna mm -hmm. just run off and fair him, so he just sat there and waited and crouched, and uh, Walrus didn't react to the visual here. Right. Or like try to bait anything out. Like you can't have it in your head that far ahead of time that you're gonna do something, because mm -hmm. we knew, Dynamic knew. <laughs> yes. yes. Jake probably knew. <laughs> but Walrus did not know. Yeah. Which is, he's the one person that needs to know. Yeah. I'm I'm guilty of that myself as well. Wallace is being a little bit better with his corner pressure this game already. He's forcing Dynamic into shield more often, and Dynamic isn't doing the correct things out of shield to beat uh, the pressure options that Wallace is choosing. I see. Uh, I don't think he Zelda? really. No, I don't to think do so that. either. Was that but, a short? Wow, good mix-up. No, I don't think it was. Maybe. Ooh, it was he actually did the Ops attack, proving me wrong. Oh my goodness, that forward smash. He could have done the forward smash in the other direction. It would have hit a get up attack, regular get up and roll, but instead he just read the roll, which is whatever. Uh, uh, he's flexing on him a little bit. Uh, I did not. Dynamic loves crash shine. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I mean, it's pretty good against Sheik. Who knows? Ooh, Dynamic getting pretty big know. damage on the Okay, stupid it worked out, but I really don't agree with going in the pit. Yes, when yeah, same. He, Falco's at 150 and you're a stock down, it just doesn't make sense to me. Yep. But it worked out, so I think maybe he... Oh, wow, he went so low. Okay. And then he poofed onto the stage. This is pretty bad. Good patience by Dynamic. I thought he was going to go in immediately. Yeah, same. Okay, Falco in the corner now, but full hop down here through. Oh, and Walrus did an accidental stage. roll. Interesting tech chase coverage. Jab, hmm. jab to cover three options and dash tower, uh, dash tech for the tech away. Right. Walrus also, the reason he lost that stock is because he tried to cheese down air into the middle of the stage, which like literally loses the shield, crouch cancel, up tilt, back air. Right. He loves to do that. So if you like just stand there and take the down air, I, I guess it's like, okay. Or if you try to challenge Sheik in the air, then you're always going to get hit by the down air. But you shouldn't bet on that sort of thing happening, especially when you're at such a deficit. Yes. Um, I really like Dynamic's patience. Mm -hmm. um, he's letting Walrus get antsy, and he's letting Walrus come to him. This is like mm -hmm. Dynamic bread and butter. He okay. must have made a technical mistake there. That was a super weird double jump down air straight yeah. into Sheik's arms. He's d been doing that every time. Walrus wants to just run off. Every time he's off stage, he wants to just run off and hit him immediately, and D Dynamic knows that, so he's just coming back with dares and stuffing. And right. Good, good recovery again. Very good recovery. I also uh, I love the laser forward tilt that Dynamic did. Laser forward tilt is extremely powerful against Sheik and most characters, if not every character. Those were good needles. Uh, kind of bad spacing and neutral by na dynamic to get hit by those needles in the first place. I think right. uh, Falco gets to choose whether or not he gets hit by those needles. Uh, <laughs> and he chose incorrectly, obviously. 
Uh, this is kind of scary, though, because Walrus knows that, like, in one hit, he's going to die, so he's probably going to go for some cheese. I mean, he right. gets nared, dies, but that could have turned into something bad. I didn't like that jump from, from Dynamics. He could have done the same thing he did before, just wait there with Crouch. Yeah, same. He's getting a little antsier, and Walrus is starting to hit him with a lot of these, uh, like, really committal aerials. Whenever they get in the same space, Walrus throws out a hitbox immediately. Right. And uh, Dynamic tends to wait more often, which I feel like is why he's, he's winning a lot of these neutral exchanges, because he knows when Walrus wants to attack. Right. Which is literally all the time. <laughs> as soon as they're like close to each other, he commits. Super weird. I think. Uh, I think there are a lot of situations uh, where uh, Sheik should contest Falco in the air if she's directly below him, with up air specifically. And Walrus, Walrus isn't really doing that. These are good needles, but it's really hard to kill off a of standing needle to catch the up B. Okay. Interestingly enough, Dynamic kills himself. Uh, this again, could be, this could be a big tech chase, although we haven't seen a big tech chase. That just might not be his style. Oh, that was so risky. That was a, a well-spaced back air and a, and a good roll. Shield roll. Oh, I knew it was all coming. I can't believe the up tilt didn't kill, to be honest. Wow. Coming down, oh, I yeah. thought he was going to come down with that. Okay. There we go. Good stuff to die, I think. Yeah, decently solid back air. Uh, good showing from Walrus, but a, a decent amount of slop in the matchup, I, I think, from both sides. Uh, I think if Walrus just expanded his matchup knowledge a little bit more and knew some of the situations more inside out, he could have capitalized off of decently small things but made them into big punishes for himself. And Dynamic playing a pretty solid game getting uh he's just tacking on like three hit combos over and 